Just over a year since this pandemic began, a lot of Hoosiers are still tr struggling to find a job or just to get their unemployment benefits. And our Faces of Unemployment Project is WRTV's commitment to tell your stories. And our Troy Washington is joining us live this morning with the story of a woman who started a company after being laid off and how she's now making sure her business stands out. Troy, good morning. Good morning, that's right. And instead of waiting around for the next opportunity to find her, she took some time to reevaluate life and take control of her career. So far, she says it's the best decision yet. Christy Zarantinello found herself without a job just as pandemic restrictions were ramping up. I was working at an air compressor company in Michigan City, and I had been there since September 2018. And since I was one of the last ones that was hired, when the pandemic hit, they let 20 people go. I was one of them. It took the LaPorte woman 10 weeks to get unemployment going. And in the meantime, the single mother leaned on savings to get by. And it just made me realize that I just did not want to ever find myself in that situation again. After doing a few interviews, she started thinking about what brought her fulfillment. Sometimes a lot of people do it just for the money. Some people do it for the benefits. Some people do it because they enjoy that type of work. Um, I basically was like, you know, what do what can I do that I can enjoy doing, um, get instant gratification on doing, make some good money and be able to to, you know, have a future with. And that's when I came up with wanting to do the cleaning company. After some planning and saving, a touch of OCD House Cleaning LLC was born. Being a cleaning company, you're you're in a competitive industry. You know, there's a lot of different cleaning companies out there. So I wanted to do something a little bit different. And so I decided that um, my different was going to be availability 24-7. Business is going good. So good, in fact, she's thinking of hiring one or two employees to help her. Such an inspiring story. Now, she says she is willing to drive up to 30 minutes away from LaPorte for deep cleanings, but she'd rather keep it local for those routine cleanings. Reporting live downtown, I'm Troy Washington, WRTV. Troy, thank you. Now, if you lost your job due to the pandemic or if you're struggling to find work, we want to hear from you. You can connect with us at wrtv.com slash faces of unemployment.